This is wheels. My beautiful race wheels. And and this is this video. I'm gonna show you right now. And racing now coming out well Sharma de Oro in the centre with Aperture and on the outside Felines began well and it's going up near the lead followed by Vanishka then you rat a bell just in behind them as they sort the order out Kokomo going up on the outside and then about four or five lengths to Winks who's beaten for speed so is Lucy's look there a long way off the lead settling down Vasek is about to go past them and ultimate dance the last of all at the 600, the leader aperture led by a length and a half feline, Sharma de Oro. Your Bell's getting a good run back along the rail. And then Kokomo, followed by Vanishka and Vaselka. Winks is now picking up a little bit of ground by the rail. Lucy's look is not travelling. It's second last and getting its ears scrubbed off. And Ultimate Dance is last. Aperture led for home. Felines is coming out after it on the outside. And then Sharma de Oro. Winks is now getting to the centre of the track and is hitting the line well. And you rat a bell, but Feline sprinted. Winks is coming after it down the outside. Feline's the leader. Winks is closing in on the outside. It's finishing very fast. Gets up. Good win. It's a Winks beating Felines. You rat a bell third. Then Sharma de Oro. Followed in behind them. Next over the line by Vaselka. Aperture. Lucy's look. Ultimate dancer. Vanishka. And last in was Kokomo. Well, showed no early speed as it had done in the barrier trials, but uh, she was very strong at the finish, coming home all over felines who didn't look like it stopped. It sat out solid lead and sprinted away, but uh, Winx has put up a big performance to win on debut after getting a long way back in the hill. And they're set off and racing, and Winx came out probably about a neck behind them. It'll settle down second to third, last on the inside, ins and outs, beat them out. And then Dallas Sewell's in forward to go to the lead in the early stages. Another round moving up on the outside and then wing for Levi. Just easing behind them to take a set in there, hiking along at a pretty good clip in the first couple of hundred metres. Then two lengths to detachment, followed by Winks on the inside, second last. And the other filly in the race, Joadja, at the tail of the field. So coming up to the 900 metre mark around the first bend, ins and outs in front. Leads by three quarters of a length on another rail and win for Levi. Then came detachment, Winks is over on the inside. And Joadja still back last of the six as they start to back the speed off now. But six lengths first to last. Ins and outs in front, leading from another rail. Win for Levi being sold along in third spot, wanted to drop the bit. Winks is picking up ground by the inside, runs appearing for her there. Then detachment back to the second last and Joadja last of all. Ins and outs in front from another rail. And then Winks has gone back towards the inside here looking for a run, but that run's ended there for it. He might have to change course and come to the outside again. Ins and outs still in front from another rail. He's drawn the whip on Winks. He's taken a little time to wind up. Now she's starting to hit her straps. Ins and outs in front. Now Winks is starting to knuckle down. Ins and outs in front, but Winks moved up on the outside. She responds when asked by the rider and comes away, wins it impressively. Ins and outs got second, another rail third. Then Joadja followed by win for Levi and last in was detachment. Well, she's a filly that uh, gives the indication that she'll be uh, appreciating longer distances in the future. Uh, she just lacks a little bit of acceleration, but then she does knuckle down very strongly at the end of her race. We saw that uh, both wins at Warwick Farm and again today. Uh, she was just a little bit outpaced at the top of the straight, even though she was slightly held up for a run. But she's really not... Solitary feeling went up. Might be all the way in though. Just seems to have propped at the back of the gates. And uh, winked.